Hello everyone, my name is Begim Langin. In this video tutorial, I'm going to introduce you to the mobile phone repair course. I've been repairing mobile phones for over three years now. These are the tools I'm using to repair mobile phones. Uh, this tool over here is called a multimeter. I use it mostly to measure voltage when measuring voltage on batteries, also when fixing charging ports, also troubleshooting some part of the motherboard, some parts of the motherboard. Okay. Right here is the soldering iron. I use the soldering iron when soldering stuff like wires, uh, when soldering speakers, also when changing the charging ports on a mobile phone. A lot of things that require soldering, or sometimes I even solder touch pads. There are some touch pads and screens that require soldering. Right here is a tweezer. This tool is called a tweezer. It has this plastic cover to cover it because it's very it's very sharp. So it's a good idea to cover it so that you, you do not get injured or maybe poke yourself. Okay, I use this tool to hold wires and other components while I'm soldering them because soldering, some components can become very hot. So you need something to hold them. I use this tool. All right, right here is a glue to glue things like screens and everything that requires glue. I use this type of glue. There are different types of glue you can use for mobile phone repair, but I use this one. Here is the soldering iron. I use the soldering, I mean, it, this is the, what do you call, it's the soldering wire. I use it for soldering every time when I'm soldering wires, uh, charging ports, speakers, uh, touch, when I'm changing the touch, I use soldering as well. If that type of touch requires soldering and some screens that require soldering too. This is called a soldering paste. Soldering paste. It is used when soldering things like ICs or maybe when you're changing a, a charging port. It is very useful. It helps so, so that your joints when soldering they do not get short circuited. So it separates the the solder, soldering wire for the melted solder so that it doesn't get short circuited. Then right here is the most important tool. This tool. Uh, the, the, this is called a, a toolkit. Uh, it contains a lot of set uh, of screwdrivers here that you can use when repairing phones. This is the handle. Uh, usually, you take one key to one here, depending on the screws you want to unwind. Then you put it on the handle here. It's it's magnetic, so you just put it in here. It's gonna be held by magnet. Then uh, you use it to unwind all the screws you want to unscrew. It's a very, it's a very important thing, like when fixing mobile phones, because you need to open the enclosures. So sometimes they are referred to as high pre precision screwdrivers, or they are just called precision screwdrivers. All right, one more last thing. This is a plier. I use it when removing some components while soldering. But I rarely use it because uh, it is very, it's very strong. So you might end up ripping off some components on the motherboard. Because I used to use it when uh, changing a charging port. So uh, since it's strong, you can end up ripping off the traces on the motherboard, and it, it can damage the motherboard. So I rarely use it unless if you use it with precaution. So it's better to replace it with a tweezer because a tweezer is very much lighter than the plier. So it's safer to work that way. Okay, for now, I'm going to leave it here. See you on the next episode.